everyone, it's me. I'm back, and I wanted to do. Let's let's take this thing down a little bit. You're a little too high for me. All right. So I wanted to do my boxy charm today. It actually came in the mail. I was a little upset. It came in the mail, but the thing that I was upset about was it's on time. It's just it was sitting outside of my apartment door. Like it wasn't in my mailbox like it usually is. It was literally outside my apartment door. So that kind of bugged me a little bit just because who knows who could take my stuff, you know? I don't understand that. I have a mailbox for a reason. Okay, so anyway, the topic for this month is sparkle and shine. Find your inner sparkle and let it shine brightly. But that bedazzled with brilliant gems, this month's box will add a little twinkle in your eye and plenty of glitz and glamour that is perfect for the holiday season. Now pop open your box, Charmers, and get your sparkle and shine on. And then, of course, on the back has all the items that you have in your box. So um, it looks like so far we have an advertisement for Kevin Murphy. I don't know what Kevin Murphy is, but there is the ad. I don't know who Kevin Murphy is. I guess I should say it that way. Um... Let me, let me, let me, let me fix this real quick. Throw all my garbage in here. All right, so, ooh, it looks like a good bag of Tarina Tarantino. Got some more Tarina Tarantino going on over here. We got a, a Eyelicity Glitter Liner. I love getting Tarina Tarantino items because her stuff is just so good. I just love getting it. So let's see. Ooh, it's very glittery. I hope it looks like that on the inside because the other one that I got from my Ipsy bag, it's literally does not have any glitter in it, at least from what I can see it doesn't. So let's see if Torino Tarantino can do any better. Okay, so there's the liner. We'll put it right next to the J Cat one. Okay, this one right off the bat, you can definitely see glitter. Definitely. So much more than the, um, sorry, not J Cat, the, uh, uh, Elizabeth Mott. So I'm already in love with this because look at this. There's definitely glitter in that sucker. This one's the Elizabeth Mott that said it was glitter. And then this one is the Torino Tarantino that actually has glitter in it. So pretty. I'm so excited. That's so pretty. Okay, so ooh, this next thing looks kind of like a little compact blush. And it is Ofra or Afra? Ofra? Blush in Paradise Pink. It's actually very heavy. It's a nice size. It's definitely full size. Oh, sorry. The uh, the Torino Tarantino liner was sixteen dollars, and this pressed blush is twenty four ninety five, and it is a beautiful color. Oh my god, that is beautiful. And it actually, I think it should open, right? Yeah. So it opens, and you have like a little compartment underneath that you can put a blush or like a pad or anything that you want to put your blush on with. So let's see how this swatches. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It's so pretty. That is beautiful. It was a little chalky at first when I put it on my finger, but that is gorgeous. I am in love already. It's really, really pigmented and it's soft too. So there's that, I'm already in love. Okay, so this next thing. Oh, this is that Kevin Murphy thing. Color bug, colored hair shadow. Colored hair shadow. Hmm. Wipe on, wash out, intense color in seconds. Change your hair color as quick as your makeup. Really? Let's open it up. Here's what it looks like. I'm guessing it's white because it looks white. I don't know. I could be wrong. I've never used hair color before. Let's try it. We'll have this be my first impressions video, huh? Okay. Oh, stupid tape. All right, let's check this out, okay? All right, so, oh, it is white. It is literally white color. And it feels like a powder, for sure. I don't know how you use this, though. I wish it gave instructions. Let's, let's read on here. Kevin Murphy Color Bug. This is $20 to $25. And it says, wipe on, wash out, intense color in seconds. Change your hair color as quick as your makeup. A safe, gentle color pad that wipes on color and washes out instantly. With a towel draped around your shoulder to protect your clothes, apply a hairstyling product and then the color bug to make it stick. You know what? I actually have some hairspray. So we're gonna apply a little bit of hairspray. We'll, we'll, we'll choose a color that's up here. We'll, we'll do this. I'm gonna apply a little bit of hairspray and then I'm gonna apply that, so. Okay, let's, let's pull that through. And then I'm guessing you just, 
I actually don't know what I'm doing right now. Oh, 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 oh my god. Okay, well, that is a... Uh... Whew. That's definitely white, for sure. I wonder if, like, it would come out. It kind of feels like it's going to come out. I kind of look like I have gray hair. I don't know if white was the best, best color for people to choose. Okay, well, anyway, that was my first impressions. I really am never going to use this. So, probably going to give this to my sister because she actually likes stuff like this. She actually likes the hair color stuff. I don't know. I, it's just not me. And I definitely don't want me to look any more gray than what I already am. I don't know. So, that's going to go to her. Okay, so it looks like I got two more things. One of them is from Micah Beauty Cosmetics, which I hate when they send me these things. I really do. If it's if it's a loose shadow, I don't like loose shadows. But it's not. It's an eye primer. This eye primer, and it says that this runs for $44.95. Jesus. Oh, my God. This thing is $45. Okay. Anyway. All right, this is a eye primer, full size, $44.95. And it looks like this. It looks very, very decently colored to my skin. And it's very creamy, so that's good. Yeah, very, very creamy. And it's very sticky, so it will definitely, definitely hold some, some powder to your eyelid. So that's wonderful. So yeah, I'm pretty impressed with that. That's nice. $45, I'll never buy it again. Okay, so this last thing is from Bella Pierre, and it is a shimmer powder. I'm pretty sure this is just an eyeshadow, which I've gotten so many of these, I don't like them. It's $14.99, and this is in the color Tin Man. Like, I wonder if I should even open it, because I'm never going to use this. I'll just open it. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll figure some kind of way to use these eyeshadows. I haven't opened any of them, and I'm I don't know if I really should use the rest of them. It's a really pretty color. It's like a really silver, silvery color, and it's very pigmented. Shoot. Maybe I should start using them. It's like so pigmented. And that was just like a little bit. So maybe I will start using these. I don't know. But that was an amazing box. Um, I always, always, always enjoy my boxy charm. It never fails to impress me. But um, yeah, I'll, li I'll list everything down below and I'll list the price of what my boxy charm actually was down below as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.